What's going on guys, Marley, welcome guys back to another Clash of Clans video, so today guys, yes we are back, and look at my sweet base, looking pretty cool, did I just remove one of my walls, no, don't, 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 don't. here we go, go back there, alright, so as you can see what I have done, I have upgraded this upper wall, as you can see, most of it done now, all I'm doing, I'm trying to do this wall all the way around, like so, except the tower now, I suppose, all the wall around this side, and I'm going to do it all the way uh, on this side here as well, and literally the front as well so literally overall uh my main concentration at the moment is try to get this wall all into uh level six so when this is done then i'm gonna try to go back into the middle and do this wall in in the middle here around all the way around at the base you know what i mean all the way this way this way all the way here back to uh the middle here or in the middle here, I suppose. And this is all going to be level 6, which is going to cost 200,000 uh, for each one of these uh, wall pieces. So, it's a lot of money. A lot of money. So, first of all, let me just collect my elixirs. I haven't actually collected them for uh, two, three hours or so. Same for the gold. Yes, look at that. <laughs> yes, baby. I'm loving this. All of my uh, gold now mines are on level 11. Yes, I'm getting so much gold. Uh, much faster i'm almost getting like one or actually two every like second or so uh so overall i'm i'm returning quite a lot of gold back you know even though they were on hold for a few days but now i'm getting a lot of gold because you know when you upgrade them literally for four days you can't get any gold from them which is a bit disappointing i was hoping you know one day actually getting upgraded uh they can like let gold at the same time but unfortunately that didn't uh, that was in the case so literally like you know uh, most of the builds in clash of clans while receiving any upgrades you can't actually use them like except the army camp and a few other builds so let's go on now with some chopping yes chop 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 we're gonna chop this massive tree ten thousand freaking elixirs to chop it down uh, this pine tree here and two of these uh, trunks and uh hopefully we're gonna get some gems so we're starting with 18 18 this is a very good number 1818 so yeah 1818 i suppose and hopefully we can get around let's say 20 gems we don't want to be too greedy 20 gems is good uh so we've got quite a few to chop down so we better get that 20 gems so here we go builders chop down some tree three two one Timber! Nothing. No. Oh, yes. Five gems. Another gem. Six gems. That's good. That's good. So the first one gave us nil. No gems whatsoever. Uh, the second two, they gave us actually six, which is good. Let's get these builders into more chopping. Yes, we have four builders literally doing nothing because I'm using all of my gold to upgrade the walls. And I keep pressing on this plant, which I placed down there. I thought it was like the mushroom. So here we go. We still have that big tree up there getting chopped. Two, one, here we go. Oh my gosh, we got three gems from this one. Uh, we have two down here getting chopped. What did we get? Oh, what did we actually get from the big one? Oh, I think we got nothing. Oh, this is crazy. Okay, so we got our dark barracks looking really sweet. And I definitely need to... Oh, we got four gems. Very good. So, I uh, definitely need to kind of get more elixir so I can actually upgrade it to the next level. And, yeah, 1,831. So, so far we've got uh, 13 gems. Good, we're not too far, we only need seven more, hopefully we get like six from this one. And I love the sound of that Christmas tree, I don't even want to chop it down, because I know I'm not going to get this back, because, oh my god, we got another five here. So, four more to go, no, two more, two more to go, and we will hit our target for the day, 20 gems, here we go. Ladies and gentlemen, I really want to get the 20 gems today. Right, here we go, come on, come on, come on, give me two gems, two more gems, and I'm good. Uh, nothing from that one here. Come on, from that one, 11 seconds. Uh, let's maybe just say uh, get busy with some troops. I need to put down some troops, should I? I really need my Lexus. I think I might just do that. Oh, just one. We need one more. We kind of failed the target for the day. Anyway, let's just put down some gems. Uh, uh, some gems. Let's just put down some troops. So get them ready for another battle. Another day. Uh, my camps are pretty full right now. So we might uh, go for an attack soon. Or I might show you one of the attacks which I did like earlier today as well. Some really epic attack. And of course, one of your amazing attacks. Yes, I have quite a few. So I'm going to try to pick one of them today. And if yours doesn't actually get showed today, maybe you'll be... In the next episode you never know you never know i will share your epic battles and sooner or later hopefully i'll have one of your battles in my video so for now uh, my barbarian is looking pretty cool i'm actually upgrading him now to level four and it is hopefully going to be a one heck of a really powerful looking at barbarian yes and for sure i'm going to actually bring him down with some little troops and we're going to actually conquer some big battles I promise you that I'm going to try my best because I'm trying to plan on a few strategies at the moment 
and uh, the barbarians are going to be a uh, they're going to actually play a huge role on the next few attacks which hopefully i'm going to be doing in the next month or so so for now all i'm doing trying to actually upgrade him to reach level six which hopefully i'm going to be able to do that soon and then i will have him with some minions attacking in some really crazy battles so uh my alexis uh, collectors or mines or whatever you guys like to call them uh they're still on level 10 so as well i need to kind of start aiming for that right after finishing my wall i need to start aiming to collect some golds to actually upgrade them to like maybe level 11 and at the same time i need to get my barrack i think this one here yes this one here actually i need to get it into level nine so i can get my dragons yes uh this is as well i, I got quite a few for the next uh step uh which i'm going to be doing so i can actually do it right now but it would cost me 589 gems <laughs> gosh this is crazy it would take a lot of days to actually collect so i don't think i'm gonna actually do it i'm gonna leave it for now and uh yeah maybe maybe we can do it some other times but for now nope i'm gonna stay strong and not change my mind because i am so freaking attempted to use my gems to upgrade and try to get some other stuff but no i really want to get my fifth builder so for now my mind kind of set let's now move into some crazy battles all righty so the first battle for the day comes from a user named twos are top oh these are top okay so this is my battle guys and as you can see straight away i've actually spawned some uh, air balloons on the right down there and I spawned some on the left literally I've divided I think I had about 30 so I've divided them into two halves because literally I wanted to go into this village from both sides yes look at the balloons they're on a pretty cool I just really wanted to destroy the air defense on the side so if you have any balloons you need to literally spawn your balloons uh, your air balloons right next to you uh, the air defense because you literally want to bring it down as soon as you can and I end up only using only one healing spell, which is very good, I suppose. And uh, like within a few seconds, I'm in control of this whole village, which is really epic when that happens. Uh, you get a really good boost. You're like, you know what? I'm going to take it down. I'm going to bring every single freaking building down. And uh, yeah, it's just an amazing feeling. So, but when you're not doing so well, you're like, oh my gosh, I can't wait for this battle to finish. As you can see in here, I'm already in control of this whole village, but... I wanted to kind of just speed up the process. I didn't want to lose this battle because of time. So literally all what I did, I just uh, spawned a few minions here and there, a few archers, uh, so we can actually speed down the destruction of this village. And it, you know what? It was really amazing. And uh, overall, I got like over 100,000 elixirs, some gold coins, some dark elixirs, and on top of that, yes, 15 trophies, which is really good. Good in out sort of quick battle. Um, amazing. I only used one, uh, you know, healing spell, I suppose, which is really cool as well. So now let's move into the second battle for the day. Alrighty, so the second battle for the day comes from the username Nando7375. Nando is one of my favorite chicken places. Yes, I freaking love Nando's. We have like those big uh, places where I go have some good chicken, like all different flavors. Lemon and herb is my favorite. Anyway, let's get in to the battle. I just reading that name just reminded me of chicken. I just can't wait. I might go have some today. And yes, it's actually grilled. Amazing flavors. It sounds like if I'm actually advertising for them, which is not. Anyway, Let's get back into this battle. The guy he's actually attacking, he is kind of rich. Look at that. The guy, he's got like 130,000 gold coins and like 170,000 or so uh, Alexis, which is really epic. And he is ripping him apart. It's a very sort of small uh, village, but overall, I really like his tactic. He went in straight with the Giants and uh, somehow those healers at the back, they just surviving all the way three. I have no freaking idea. I mean, this guy probably has no... Uh, you know air defense so literally those healers they are just staying back there helping those giants to literally chop down the through this village and uh, the archers on the side literally raping every single thing in their way uh, I mean straight away as well he spawned a few archers at the bottom here as you can see they're destroying uh, the clan castle so overall Nandu7375 playing with a very good tactic he's trying to literally break down everything at the same time in a very fast time which is really cool so um, yeah, very good battle. If you have any more crazy battles, make sure to always share them. I'm always recording those battles, the old epic battle. And as I said, if you don't actually see a battle in this video, maybe it's going to be in the next video. You never know. And um, I hope you guys, you know, enjoying those Clash of Clans videos. And if you are, make sure to continue that support on this series. Hit that like button. It definitely helps. And those battles are just super freaking epic. I love them. This is why I like to share them with you guys. So I hope you guys like my battles as well and like your battles as well. Uh, overall, I hope you guys liking the Clash of Clans. If you are, thank you very much for watching. And I hope you guys enjoyed this one. So I'll see you guys later. Take care for now and bye-bye. Peace.